We'll just get over that ridge and then we'll start dropping down. It's minus 27 up here. <laughs> oh, geez, that's crazy. Welcome back everybody to Subsistence. I am an old guy gaming and in this episode we are going to go explore the new territory off to the west. Um, so it is morning. It's fairly early in the morning and I think we're about ready to go. Everything's repaired. Uh, we've got three chickens that I've gathered up and uh, let's take a look at their food and water. It's in pretty good shape. Okay, so they're good to go. Um, moving forward, we're going to now separate each crop plot into each vegetable. So this will be tomatoes, this will be potatoes, this will be uh, carrots, and this will be onions once these are finished growing. Um, here's where we are on our food. Let's go ahead and eat a baked ch or roast chicken now. Oh man, that's delicious. And we are now up to 104 uh, with our health cap and 103 with our stamina cap. Uh, but I'm out of carrots completely and sh low on potatoes. Uh, onions aren't doing too bad. Uh, we almost have two full stacks of tomatoes now, and that's why I switched the crop, uh, crop <laughs> plots over. Um, so, yeah, that's where we're at with that. We got a full stack. Oh, boy. We got company. This is probably Bravo, I'm thinking, because I've been attacked by Charlie and... Um, Come here, you bastard. Don't make me chase you all the way to the shore. He's going to make me chase him all the way to the shore. No, he's not. Okay. So, yeah, that is probably all the attacks that we'll get for now. Because I got attacked by Charlie twice yesterday and Alpha once. And these guys, I'm pretty sure these guys are Bravo. Do we see that other guy that derps out behind the fence? I don't know. Um, they did launch something up there. Let's take a look at it. It's probably not in too bad a shape cause, since, like I said, everything was fully repaired until that attack. Uh, it's a little bit cracked. We should probably touch that up. We need to get going, though, because we have a long journey ahead of us, and we need to get there, look around, and then get back. So we got to scooch. All right, let's see. That goes in there. That goes in there. Those go in there. That goes in there. We're going to give this to the chickens because I have a full stack. Uh, I see an onion over there? No. I have a full stack of seaweed in the refrigerator. And you can go in there. Uh, you can go in there. You can go up there. Okay, so let's see. We got 20 arrows. Or I'm kind of low on pistol ammo, but that's all right. We got five shotgun shells. Uh, yeah, five shotgun shells. You know what? I'd like a few more shotgun shells. So let's go to three. Well, that's about all we're going to do. We're really low on gunpowder. We got a ton of casings, uh, but super low on gunpowder. And um, I'm doing good. I got 209 nails, over a full stack of wood, over 100 planks. I'm making more planks, as you can see here. Um, so as soon as we can get our nails up just a little bit more, uh, we'll be ready for another building episode. All right, let's just quickly grab this and go out and tap that wall out there. Was it that one? Which one was it? This one. Oh, crap. I'm supposed to grab wood, not boards. Silly me. Okay, we'll grab that. We'll get this wall repaired, and then we're, we'll take off. I've got... Uh, you know, the weather's nice right now, uh, but is everything else good? I think so, yeah. Uh, you know, if the, if the weather turns bad on us, we have our winter coat, and we also have uh, three heat packs with us as well. Let's go ahead and make another pick. 
um, just so we have it since this one's get starting to get down in case we whoa <clears throat> in case we get lucky and run into a whole mess of ore while we're out and about all right so we'll put this one here and then that other picks being made we'll just take the rest of these boards with us okay so we are good on food and water since we're going on a long journey let's take 10 protein bars with us too and you know we'll probably find blueberries rosehip berries that sort of thing along the way so we should be good with that uh, gardens should be in reasonably good shape fire should be in reasonably good shape let's top off our Jenny here and uh, we're ready to go okay let's do it let's vamanos so yeah when we uh, I, I just want a little bit more nails like I said and then we then we'll do our next building episode uh, in which we're going to uh, work more on the interior of our base and we'll expand those walls out get some a roof over our head and stuff like that actually we're gonna go this way we're gonna cut up through uh, right through there and I don't know if we can get to the new area from the glacial uh, the gla glacier runoff valley you know where the little glacial stream is I looked at the map that he posted on the, in the release notes and we might be able to scooch over the mountaintop there but if we can't um then you you got to go all the way up to pine lake which is in the north to get around according to what i was seeing on that map so you know we'll just go this way we'll go up the glacial creek valley and see if we can get over there and if we can't well then you know we'll just loot along the way and we'll know for next time um it'd be it, it would seem weird though that he wouldn't make a way to get over there from from down south here so maybe you can so we'll just we're gonna find out that's what we're gonna do we're gonna find out all right so yeah not a whole lot else to update on you we're not gonna hunt um, we're just gonna avoid animals we are definitely gonna loot crates so that crates a little bit close to Alpha's base so I think we're gonna not mess with that. That'll probably trigger the, another attack from them. And yeah, I'm just curious to see what this uh, new area is going to look like here. It looks like I might have another birchwood forest in it again, based upon what I was seeing on the uh, on, in the release notes and the maps that he posted, that Cold Games posted. Now we're hitting the crates today, baby. These are the this is the morning batch of crates. That wolf is gonna be a pain in our butt. I don't have time to mess with him. Let's just get him out of our way and keep moving. I would have gone around him, but there's uh you know, we gotta get these crates, so I'm not gonna pass those up. There's a couple livers we can chow down on later if we need to. Oh, look, a locked crate. Hot darn, let's get it. Nice. Okay, wow, look at that. Eight shotgun shells. Yeah, that's a reasonably decent crate. I'll take it. Okay, yeah, let's keep moving up this way. Uh, yeah, all right. That's a level one wolf. Yeah, since our hands are bloody, we might as well take him out too. I want to get my bow upgraded um, ASAP, but before we do that, the next I, I'm still I still want to get at least one, maybe even two turbines, uh, wind turbines going. So that's really the next priority on my list of stuff to build. But uh, I've just spent. Um, a lot of my power in particular uh, and some mass you know uh, cooking and making lock picks wow look at that we're already up to 33 nails man that's great uh, let's eat these blueberries now and I'm just gonna eat that stuff too we'll grab this copper I almost have two full stacks of raw copper ore and a, and a full stack of copper fragments we have a lot of copper more than I think I've ever had in playing this game. Okay, we are getting cold, and that's partially because we're gaining altitude. So let's put... Oh, crap. I was going to fix this shirt. Oh, dang it. 
I always forget something, right? Uh, there's a crate up this way. Let's go run up and grab that. And I'll use one of my water bottles to wash my hands here pretty soon. But we might kill another wolf first. Yeah, it gets cold as you get up higher. Now, we are definitely getting up higher. But this is a building crate. And I don't want to pass that up. Look at those nails. 48 nails already. That's a beautiful thing. Okay. Let's move this way. We are going to have to keep an eye on our health. I kind of don't want to take a health, or I mean a heat pack, unless we get into a blizzard. Uh, but we'll just have to kind of monitor it and see how things are going there. All right. Let's make another bandage. And let's go ahead and wash our hands right now. Okay. So the down the downside to all of this is if we can oh shit. If we can get over there, uh, we are going to have to go over the mountains a bit based upon what I was seeing on the map and that's going to be cold. So we we'll probably we probably will have to pop one of our heat packs. But we have to go all the way to the to the end of the valley. Let's just let's leave that copper there. Um, I want to get keep moving here. I don't know this. This may not actually be. A, oh, we can't pass up iron. That's not gonna happen. All right, yeah, we better take one of these now. Um. This yeah, this might. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a really good idea. Maybe we should wait till spring, but it'd be kind of cool to see the new territory in the winter time, though. All right. Yeah, let's just kind of run up over the top of this ridge and just kind of peer over there and see if it looks like we can get through. It's minus 15 degrees up here. And, and you know, if, if a blizzard starts, then, then we really got to get the hell out of here. No, there's a fence there. Oh, shoot, really? Okay. So that would seem to indicate that... We can't get over there? Let's just follow the fence line for a little bit. I think we can get behind this mountain here, but I don't have enough heat packs for that, unfortunately. Uh, but I just let's just run up kind of to where we start getting to that peak. It's 18, minus 18 now. Uh, and see if the fence curves or if it just keeps going along the back of the mountain here. I've actually been along here before. There's nothing up here. It's just just snow and cold. Minus 24. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I'm thinking we better turn around. So it seems to me like... Oh, no, it does. It does start to turn. Oh, look at that. Wow, okay. All right. Our heat pack just ran out, so if we don't start dropping down real quick here, we're going to have to turn around. What in the world? Look at that fence. Okay, we got to take this. It does drop down, you guys. Check it out. All right. Okay. So we should be able to, you know, we got... We still have this one more heat pack that we can use to get back across this mountain. Um, it looks like the sun's more or less in the middle of the sky. So we're not going to be able to spend a lot of time here. And let's hope and pray it doesn't start. Uh, you know, a blizzard doesn't start. If it does, I mean, I guess we could make a fire and just hunker down by the, a fire for the night. Um, that might work. <laughs> I don't know. 
I don't know. Oh, yeah, see, we're out of stamina. Okay, um, we're low on protein, so let's eat this, that, and that. Okay, that, that, oh, shoot, a blizzard's coming. Of course a, a blizzard's coming. Doggone it. All right, well, oh, look at the new trees. This is cool, man. Those are, that's a new uh, species of trees. We haven't seen these kind before. They're like lodgepole pine or something. Oh, nifty. Okay. All right, we got a wolf and a chicken. It'll be interesting to see where the the locked crates spawn in the new territory. We need to get down lower. Um, oh, there's a mountain lion. Look at that. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, let's get down lower here. I love the new tree, so that is cool looking. I do have stuff to make a, a fire starter. Is that a, a new kind of, of tree? I don't th think so. I think that's the usual suspect there. Uh, I'd rather not mess with that white wolf. Oh, we got a body of water here. I think there's like two lakes or large ponds if I remember right from looking at the the map. This is kind of interesting. This one's all up against a cliff. I think these are new trees here. Yeah, those are new trees. That's cool. Okay, we got a little a little crick there blowing down, so let's follow that. If we can get down to the you know the the big lake, that's where it'll be as warm as it'll get um, in terms of the altitude. Oops. Uh, I guess we'll grab this. We might as well since we're here, right? seeing grub trees. Oh, there's a moose. Okay. I'm not going to bother him, and he shouldn't bother us. So this is this must be the shore of the big lake then. Let's see where we're at here. Yeah, I think that's probably the the case. Or is it? Well, uh, I don't know. Yeah, this looks like a pretty good sized lake. And I think there's a, you know, the fence runs out across it after a while. It's minus 7 here, though, so we can handle 7.5 as long as we don't get wet. Yep, there's the fence there. Okay, cool. Very cool. So let's... Uh, uh, where's the sun? It's early afternoon. I, I do not want to attempt to go over back over the mountain in a blizzard. So we probably better build a fire and just hunker down and wait the blizzard out. Okay. Um, all right, so let's make our... Oh, we're going to have to get some wood first. So let's let's chop one of the new trees here. Is this a four log tree? Let's see. Yes, it's a four log tree. Okay. Now let's make some sticks. And make a fire starter. And a campfire. I'm gonna get some more wood here. Well, can't do anything about that right now. And more sticks. And more sticks. <laughs> 
That's the one we... Oh, no, this is a different one. Yeah, I know. It would have been smarter for me to wait till spring to come over here, but I... I was dying to see it. Well, I might literally be dying to see it. <laughs> I don't know, man. This is it's a little touch and go right now, but that's all right. It's all, it's all good. Okay, let's uh, stay away from the wolf. Um, minus seven uh, right in this area. Our health is at 71. I've got, you know, I've got three many packs too, so we really needed to use them. I just want to look around a little bit more before we hunker down. Just to see what there is to see. We'll definitely be coming back here in the springtime, uh, you know, when everything's all nice and green and stuff. But uh, yeah, I like those new trees. I think those are cool, man. How far back this way stuff goes. There's another wolf over there. I think these are some of the new rocks that he work he was working on. It's a white wolf. What is it? It's still January. Okay, yeah. We're still in the the tight grip of winter here. It's got to be pretty late January by now, though, I'm thinking. All right, let's stay away from that wolf. We kind of come back down to the lake shore here. Uh, we got another wolf. Do we have any protein? Other well, we got the protein bars. Yeah, let's... Uh Okay, it looks like the blizzard's starting to <coughs> subside. Um, you know what I think I might do? I have a feeling like we can't really go too much further this way. There's another crick here. Oh, that, with a waterfall too. That's neat. You know, I, I wouldn't necessarily... Yeah, there's the fence right there. Okay. I wouldn't necessarily um, mind trying to run home in the dark as long as it's clear. There's another level two wolf. Yeah, we can't really... We can't really explore up high right now because it's just too cold. I only got the one heat pack, and we've got to make sure we hang on to that so we can get back across the mountain when the time comes. Oh, let's not jump down there. Last thing we need right now is a broken leg. And we're out of stamina again. Where's the sun? Yeah, there's no way we'll make it back home by dark. Um... Oh, there's a crate over there. Okay, let's go back over here. Maybe it'll have a... Oh, this is a building crate. Okay, that's fine. We'll take that, too. 57 nails. It's a beautiful thing. All right, well, we could... Let's just eat this now um, and eat a couple of these. We'll take a drink of water... And, uh, you know, that gets us a little bit of energy back there. Why don't we also cut a hole in the ice to wash our hands so we're, we save our waters. Okay, cool. All right, well, let's start heading back. Um... And then all, you know, we'll have to decide if we're going to try and make it back over the mountain tonight uh, or if we're going to plop down a campfire and just, you know, wait it out until morning 
That looks really neat, though. I'm looking forward to coming back here and exploring, you know, back up in there. But it's just too cold for us to do that right now. I am glad, though, that we can get over here from the south and we don't have to go all the way up north and around, even though it's a cold trek getting over that mountain. But, you know, it'll, it won't be a big deal in the spring and summertime, though. Okay, let's go up here. Here's another crate. Haven't seen any locked crates over here yet. And another crate. What you got for us, Mang? Four nails. 65 nails. That's a nice haul. That is a nice haul. There's a wolf and a chicken and a rabbit. Okay, let's avoid all of them. Let's look at the map here now. Okay. So let's go all the way to the south until we hit the border, and then we'll kind of work our way back up towards the, the mountain pass here. Hey, why isn't... Oh, I was going to say, why didn't that area get uncovered? But it's because I had the map scrolled way over to the side. Oh, it's only minus three right now. Of course, we're down really low. And it's not storming. Blizzarding. Okay, here's the fence. So, yeah, let's go ahead and... Yeah, see, this is starting to climb in elevation, though. I don't like that. Minus four. <coughs> Let's get this guy out. Got a level one something there. Oh, look at that. Ammo crate. Very nice. There's that. That's a bunny. Okay, it's minus seven right here. Did we come down this way? Yeah, we did. It's like a little trail there. Okay, well... Um... Do we try and make it over the pass? Tonight or not? That is the question. 76 nails. Kind of wished I would have made at least one more heat pack now, but... Minus 10. Alright, there's the mountain pass there. Yeah, you know what? I I think we can do this. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna go until our health is about halfway gone. And then we're gonna pop the heat pack. Um, you know, one thing that might be a bit of a challenge with this though is stamina. Let's eat some more protein bars. We're not going to be able to do much about fruits and veggies at this point. And we'll drink a couple waters. Okay, that got us some stamina back. We're going to have to go through there. It's minus 17 now. Yowzers! And our stamina is really tanking. Minus 20. It's getting super low now. Or, not our health, I'm sorry, our stamina. So let's just keep moving. This is the worst of it right here. We'll just get over that ridge and then we'll start dropping down. It's minus 27 up here. <laughs> oh, jeez, that's crazy. Okay, minus 28. All right, let's take this. And let's also take our health back. All right. 
Oh, nope, nope, nope. We gotta keep going this way. Alright, keep moving. We should be fine. Unless we don't run into, like, an abominable snowman or something up here. There's where the fence curves. Okay. Minus 28. Yikes. Yeah, it's minus 26 here. Yeah, whatever. Okay, we're out of stamina. Thought I heard a, a cougar. But I think it was just my feet crunching on the snow. Come on, stamina. Okay, let's stop for a minute. Uh, there isn't any, really anything we can eat. Well, yeah, we can eat more of these. There, now our stamina is starting to shoot up. We still have another couple minutes on the heat pack, too, so we should be fine. Okay, let's just walk until the stamina gets all the way up, and then we'll start sprinting again. We got this, you guys. We got this. Okay, so there's the headwaters of the, the glacier glacial runoff. So let's make a beeline for that. We do want to watch out for mountain lions. We are in their territory once we start getting down towards the water there. Uh, let's look on our path and make sure there's no rogues anywhere. Nope, there's no rogues. Okay, we're good. Okay, heat pack wore off. Let's just keep moving. We're absolute worst case scenario. I've got two more health packs to boost our health back up if we if we really need to. Oh, mountain lion. Okay, let's go this way. There. I'm not going to stop for that potassium. I just want to get back down to the lowlands. Okay, we'll take one feather, sure. <laughs> There's a theory that in the winter time uh, you get less loot. I don't know if that's actually true or not, but it kind of seems that way. The bunny. Oh, it's minus six. Okay, we can handle minus six. <clears throat> Level three something or other over there, probably a white wolf. Let's go this way. We just have to listen for that telltale purring that the cougars make. Level one cougar right there. You know what? Let's kill him. that and that get some protein going and let's vamanos yeah we're good now man that's only minus five we are good now keep thinking I'm I hear more purring ammo crate Check in there. This is where 
I have my base in uh, on the multiplayer server. Right here, right up against this cliff. Kind of a neat spot for a base, actually. Uh, let's cut a hole in the ice and wash our hands real quick. I haven't been running water in my drill for a long time because I've been getting iron from it. Look at the sun. Nice. Okay. <coughs> well, guys, um, I think I'm probably going to let you go here. And I'm just going to work my way back to the base. Uh, get whatever repairs done that the uh, hunters did to us whilst we were away. If we're no longer in, in danger of the cold, let's, might as well stop and get this. And then I think the next plan of action is I'm going to keep, you know, doing some off camera looting to get the nails built up a little bit better than they are. And um, in the next episode, the plan will be to work on the base continue working on expanding the interior and to get one or two wind turbines made. So I think that's what we'll plan on doing for the next episode. So with that, I would like to thank all of you for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel, leave a comment and share out the video and we shall catch you in the next episode. Bye bye. Another crate. Oh, we need those carps. Om nom nom. See ya.